What's happening, dude? Yo. Yo. Am I video on? Is this right? Yes, Is I see it? you. You're here. Yo. Yo, dude, the keyboard and everything, it's all there, man. You were late. What happened? Well, poggers. Um, honestly, I was making coffee. Okay. <laughs> Drink up. <laughs> So, uh, what's up? Like, what have you been doing recently? How's your day? Uh, I've been in bed all day. Bed Honestly, day. I've been in bed all day dreading the stream, so... Oh, <laughs> so, shit. What are you scared of? I don't know. Um, being on streams is very scary nowadays. You are, I, you, I don't wanna... You were on Healthy Gamer GG recently. Yeah, and that you, was really scary. That was, like, the scariest thing I've ever done. And you did your own stream as well? Yeah, okay. uh-huh. What made you want to go in Healthy Gamer? Did you think he would like help you with your issues? Yeah, so what happened was uh, he asked me, they reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to do an interview and I had always really uh, like admired and respected their work and what they did because I think Dr. K has a really good way of like pulling things out of people and really analyzing someone's brain and uh, getting to the bottom of their problems and why they do things. And I just thought that was really cool. I really like psychology too. So, um, so oh. yeah, when he asked me, I was just like, sure. Did he teach you anything new? Like, did you learn anything from the stream? Anything um, that's like that? Yeah. Well, I mean, definitely ever since his stream, it was very like emotionally exhausting to be so open because I have a really big problem processing and like opening up about my feelings. Uh, he taught me like little methods, you know, like meditation methods. And, um, oh, yeah, where he goes, oh, yeah, 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 true. Indeed, is that, true. yeah, yeah, so like, yeah. I mean, what did you, you talk to him? Do you meditate? What, huh? Do you meditate? I do not. Are you, are you a meditator? I can't do it. I at think all. you should meditate. You should try. I should try it. I am kind of a hyper person, but I can't really sit still. Yeah. yeah, well, you should do it on stream. I bet they'd like it. Yeah, I'm sure they would. But, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. did you learn anything from him? Did he, like, what did you tell him? Did you tell him anything specific? Was it about the Carson situation? Was it something else? Depersonalization? I, ta I, ta I told him about uh, lots of shit. We talked about my my relationships, yeah, the fact that I cheated. We talked about, which was, yeah, that was, that was, that was good. You cheated? Who did you um, cheat on? I cheated on my boyfriend. Your boyfriend? Not so not Carson, right? So you let him on. No, but I was involved with Carson. Yeah, I did leave Carson on. That sucks, yeah. I mean, are you like on good terms with Carson and Fitz? Um, I don't talk to them. <laughs> have you cleared the air with them at least? Yeah, kind of. You have, yeah. kind of. What does that mean yeah. by kind of? Just fill the beans. Well, it's best, you know, Carson, I decided it's best not to talk right now. But, you know, the last time we talked, it wasn't terrible. But I don't want to go into too much detail. So, yeah. So yeah, we cleared the air. Pretty much. I saw Carson donated 10k during the Healthy Gamer thing. Yeah. Did you, did you know he was gonna do something like that? Was nope. it random? <laughs> no. No. Nope. No, I did not know. I, I haven't talked to him in a in a minute. What did you consider that like some sort of cuck behavior, like donating 10k? Like no, bro, he didn't donate 10k to me. He True. didn't donate 10k to me. True. If I pocketed that shit, then maybe, sure, maybe sure. Sure, yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah. he donated that to a fucking. A smart-ass guy who goes on and helps people with their problems. How can he? How can you hate on that? True. Yeah. I mean, like, yeah. I mean, he got cheated on, let on by a girl, and he don't. I mean, yeah. That's not cocky. That's totally normal. But, uh, like, okay. <laughs> Did you do that too much? Uh, maybe I'd consider it. I mean, he seems like a nice guy. Maybe he'd help me if I gave him. Doctor Cruz is really cool. Yeah, he is. So, you've been silent for a while. Where you been? What have you been up to? Laying in bed? Uber Eats? A lot, yeah. No, I cook. I cook a fuck ton. I don't order Uber Eats. Shit, so if you were like, if you were loyal, you'd be like a really good wife. Yeah, I was loyal. Yeah. So, I, I don't mean to offend but you. I don't like cleaning too much, so I, I, I have like half of it. I'm Ooh. good at cooking. Um, half woman, half gamer. True. Real. Half. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Half woman, half gamer. I have also been playing video games a lot. True. Okay. With Carson? And Reed. With any of the S&P guys? No. No? Okay. <laughs> no. Okay. Oh, anyway. All right. I want you to be brutally <laughs> honest, okay? Just 100% honest. People uh, are saying there's uh, like 13 dudes, 14 dudes. What's the real number? Four. Four. Okay. So there was like, there was seven dudes that were supposedly confirmed. There's XUC saying that he wasn't naming somebody. What's up with that? I don't know, actually. At, um... Like, you forgot or... I... 
No, I did not forget. Oh. Um, it was, I've told you, or I've said it on stream, but it was Fitz, Carson, my ex-boyfriend, and Dom. And um, so they're not at the same time. So your ex-boyfriend being the blonde guy that nobody knows about. Yeah. Right, yeah, okay. Dom was not at the same time as Fitz. Yeah, okay. So there was a guy in that one clip, that TwitchCon clip, where it was like, I don't remember his name, but he was like an ice beside guy. And then there was this dude who was like, Yo, can I bring my girlfriend over when you're like do a song or some shit? Do you remember that clip? Yeah, that was that was my friend Sorty Way, okay? And he was joking. Friend, friend. And... Wait, 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 wait. Let's just like clarify. What is a friend? Because yeah. Carson, was he a friend or were you involved with him? No, Carson and I were involved. We okay. were definitely like So yeah. he was just saying that for the good meme? Like he was saying you're my girlfriend? Yeah, he was saying that for the meme, yes. Yes. What a fucking Sorty Way and I were sim- never, ever, ever, ever romantic. <laughs> He's just He's just like the guy. He's, He's just there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's talk about your apology. Like, you put out an apology, yeah, and people didn't really like it. Did you make Would it? Would they have liked any apology I made? I mean, honestly, kind of, right? Like, you know, you think so? Yeah, I mean, if you like apologize for what you said, but you did talk about something called depersonalization. What is that? What yeah, is why, why do you say it like that? Too bad. I don't know why what that is. Like I don't know what it is. Like, depersonalization. What if I say it? doesn't, like, I don't know what it is. It, to me, it sounds like something that. You know could be used as a shield you know what i mean to not take account ah. of it. but what is it well i mean if you if you watched my streamer dr k's you'd know that i did take accountability and i have and uh it is 100 percent my fault and i made the decisions to hurt these people you know and that was on me not any depersonalization or anything um i explained depersonalization because i think it would have been stupid if i had just gone on uh Gone on camera and what are you, what are you doing? To me? Oh, you're watching my stream. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, yeah, nothing. I got it open. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I, I didn't know open. you're watching my I, stream. I, I, yeah. I wanted to see you, you, you dancing. You know, you're having a good time. You're running around. Yeah. No, that that window open. Yeah, my computer's <laughs> glitching. It's having issues or something. Like it's freezing. But uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you okay, made a new yeah, apology, no and you said that you apologized for what you did. Yeah, and um, I actually do feel very bad because i didn't mean for it to come across as you know me trying to shield with depersonalization because i take full accountability for what i did you know um like i've said in my stream and dr k's and i don't i think i'm 100 percent at fault you know i don't think there's any other way to look at that okay uh but i think it's it's uh hmm did something change because originally with the apology it was something about depersonalization mm-hmm. feeling like you're a passenger in your own body what did you mean by that i'm like i just really want to ask you so depersonalization mean? is like is you know have you ever felt like disassociation or anything like that absolutely not but tell us That's awesome yeah you only know schizophrenia right? True. <laughs> uh so disassociation depersonalization is like a type of disassociation pretty much yeah. uh they're different though and depersonalization is like so basically, I talked about this on Dr. K stream. Um, so I made the decisions to cheat, right? That was me. Um, but the reason that it went on so long, uh, which was, you know, also my decision, you know, not saying it's not. Um, but basically, when I get really anxious or stressed about something, and I was anxious and stressed about a lot of different things. Uh, including the fact that I chose to cheat, which, you know, it's stupid and it's terrible. Um, but uh, when I when I get really anxious and stressed, I depersonalize. Um, and so I was depersonalizing through the whole thing. And so it felt like, you know, like I said, I was a passenger in my own body and like I was just not really living, I guess, if that makes sense. Um, I guess, yeah, yeah, some Nazi zombie type beat. Yeah, yeah. I, I didn't really feel like a zombie or a Nazi, but, you know, if that clears up in your head, sure, too, man. Oh, shit. Okay, sorry. Yeah, I mean, that didn't mean to pull up that word. You know, he was family friendly, but... Okay, what was going through your head when you were leading on Carson? Because you made videos with him. You were, like, exploding mm-hmm. on all mm-hmm. your platforms. Like, how did you feel about that? Were you depersonalized, whatever the word is, the entire time? Yeah, I was. Um, so it's I a was... constant thing. It's like a phase. You're in it. Yeah, it's like, yeah, for, well, for six months, it just felt like I was, like, this shell, you know, of, like, a person not really living or being there. I was just kind of, like, 
you know how when you're going through life and your eyes are like here right in the center of your yes. your vision you can see things it kind of feels like your 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 vision's back here like you're like watching your body move and it i know okay i don't want no, it to it. seem like i didn't but i mm-hmm. i also take full responsibility you know what i mean yeah um you did and, afterwards later on you did yeah, yeah i do um and i did like I did have feelings for for Carson, you know. I had, we were very close. So, like, I mean, was he convinced that you guys were together, or was it like unsaid? No, no, it was. Mm, so, like, I don't know how much put, I want to say. The impression was put on the internet that you guys were a thing, and it was like super obvious. But with you guys, yeah, what was and it? we we established like, okay, this is you know, we're gonna play this up for content. You know, we established that. Oh. Um, so wait, well, wait, 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 wait. If you established that it was for content, what was the issue? If it was because, for content. Because, because we established that in the beginning, and then as our as our friendship continued and we grew closer outside of it, we developed feelings for each other. And... It was originally you know, for the content. Feelings when was it for content? Content. When did that start? We decided that it was good for both of us. Like at the beginning um, of when you met, like on Raj? Or? Yeah. Okay. No, before Raj. Before Raj? Um... I think so, actually. I don't know. No, it was after Raj. Um, I don't really know. It's hard to did piece you, together Did you develop feelings for Carson? Or was it just yeah. one way? Yeah. We, well, because, no, it was, because we spent a lot of time together, you know? Like, we talked a lot off stream. And, I mean, we went to Disney together for a weekend, you know, yeah. obviously. Like, and there's pictures and I don't shit. know. Yeah, and it was, I don't know. We were, we were very close. Okay. And, yeah. What did you feel about Carson? This is weird. Videos? Yeah, I know it's weird. I mean, chat's asking one question. Do you want to answer that? Is Fitz packing? Is that something you're comfortable answering? I mean, I don't. I don't think he's he's going anywhere. Why would he be packing? Oh, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's staying home. Coronavirus. Um, yeah. So yeah, I, that's weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. Yeah. So. <laughs> so, how did you feel about Carson leaking the situation on Reddit? Like, what was that like? Um. It was. I mean. Of course it was gonna happen, right? Like, I don't know, it felt inevitable. Was it gonna happen um, though? Like, like, before, okay, how did Carson find out? Like, once you had sex with Fitz, who told him? How did you find out? Like, Fitz told him, did you tell him? Um, no, uh, Miz Kid told him, actually. The fuck? Oh shit, we're bringing a new person into this drama. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Wait, it's... wait, wait, how did Miz find out? What? How did Miz Kid find out? Who told him? His friend. It's a long story. Okay, it's a well, long tell us story. The long but story. They, they talk, I don't want to talk about the long story. Okay. Okay. I mean, uh, can you simplify it? Maybe. Like, how yes. did this get through all these people? Like, what's happening? Like, well, okay. First of all, how? What was the time span like? When did you have sex with Fitz and cheat? And then when did Carson find out? How long was it? Months? Weeks? Days? I have vaginismus. I never had, like, sex with any of them. Wait, you didn't have sex with Fitz? This is really uncomfortable to talk about, bro. The fuck? Too mad? <laughs> Shit, I don't do this um, for a living. I'm not no Chris Hansen, but like... Wait, you yeah, didn't have sex you, with you Fitz? Me. You're good. You're like, you're very boom, boom, boom with the, with the questions. I'm impressed. Sorry, yeah. I mean, did you have sex with Fitz or... What? I don't want to go into detail, okay. but what I will say is that I have vaginismus, okay? What, what is that? Vaginismus? <laughs> Christmas? What? Vaginismus is like... Yeah, so basically, uh, I talked about it on Dr. K, but vaginismus is like, um, vaginismus is like, uh, you, you still, computer still having troubles, too, man? No, yeah, sorry. Um, that is, yeah, you're good, you're good. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> it's like, it's hard to explain. It's basically like, <laughs> the muscles of your vagina tighten because of my PTSD with I talked about this all in Dr. K, but yeah. Wait, what so, the fuck? Yeah, Wait. yeah, bro, it's gnarly. Vaginus is gnarly. Look it up. It's a thing. And honestly, a lot of people here, if they're girls, so it didn't, they might wait, have Hold up, hold Vaginus up. Is, wait, so it didn't fit. Because it doesn't open. Okay. I'm, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, I mean, you pretty much apologize for everything. Okay. But here's the real question. <laughs> what are you going to continue with? Are you going to come back to the community? Are you coming back? Are you going to try to? <laughs> Um, 
I want to keep streaming. There's a lot of people who continue to support me, and I don't want to let those people down. Um, and I also enjoy streaming, and I want to keep trying at it, you know? Um, I don't expect, I don't know, I, I want to do things differently, you know, obviously. I'm not going to, I don't want to ever do, like, shipping content again, for example. Oh, yeah, no, for sure. Um, yeah, and I don't know, I guess right now what I'm doing is just focusing on my mental health and kind of trying to take every day at a time, you know, it's like some days are a lot harder than others and whatever. Um, and yeah, I'm planning on coming back to stream, but just at my own pace, I guess. Okay. Okay. When you, when you, when why does your, why is your chat? They, they really, I don't know. I don't it's YouTube chat. Everyone's quarantined. Why would you, why, why would they be packing? Yeah. Bro? Yeah. True. Why would you do no fucking luggage Where out here? Where are they going? No one's going anywhere. You guys are so dumb. True. So, um, with Carson, when you let him on, was it for clout? Were you trying to juice up? No. I had genuine feelings for Carson. Okay. You get why people would think that, though, right? Because you put out so many videos. Yeah. Did you ever feel bad yeah. for, like, putting out videos and stuff like that during that? Um, not until after. Because after, before, during it, it's like, it's like living, I don't know, I fucking... <laughs> I'm a dumbass, honestly. Uh, 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 I, yeah, wow. It just sounds like, just sounds like your schizophrenia is acting up. I don't yeah, know. I don't know what I'm really saying. I've got some issues. Yeah, I've got some PTSD from fucking. Yeah, yeah. you got vaginismus, too, man. Yeah, I got vaginal. Christmas. <laughs> vaginal Christmas. Aww, mm -hmm. <laughs> presents. Yeah. So um, <laughs> you're trying to come back. Yes. Do you think people are going to accept you? Like, are you going to try and, like, collab with people? Like, because as far as I can tell, like, this is, like, career ruining. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, I just want to kind of do my own thing. I don't know. I don't really care about collabing with people. I don't really care about, like, um, people wanting to collab with me or not. It's mostly just about me continuing to do my thing and find what I want to do. Um, I really want to, you know, continue doing music and stuff like that and, um, I like painting and <laughs> I don't know, um, but yeah, I yeah do normal things. And yeah, I I want to do my own thing. I'm gonna focus on myself and like my community and shit because I obviously made a lot of mistakes and I am so trying during, not to do that. Anymore. During your you know fucking rumors like all the shit going down, has there been rumors like things that aren't true, things that you want to like clear up? Things that you've heard on yes. the internet, it's not true. There are several, there are so many rumors. Um, oh, one rumor that was, that really triggered me actually. Uh, my boyfriend at the time did not know that I was involved romantically with Carson. He thought it was all for content, okay? So like, he did not, so he was no okay idea. with that. That's a sim, that's a cock, 100%. Can't you admit that? No. Well, it is. No, it's, it's fucking, It's like an eyebrow no. situation. No. Okay. Well, I don't want to fucking cuck. Okay, I don't know. Do you have a girlfriend? Do no. you have a girlfriend to be a cuck for? You, stu you no, dumb bitch. Unfortunately. <laughs> I, I mean, I mean, if he was okay with that shit going down, then it's like, okay, kind of weird, but he's probably not. Well, no, he didn't, but he didn't know about, like, the fact that Carson and I were actually romantically involved. And I think it's stupid that people were saying that. And... Yeah, I mean, there are a lot of rumors. Do you think it's stupid, though? I said it, everything that is true. Is it what? stupid to think that, though? Because, like, it was for content and all, but, like, it became, like, hmm. a thing. Like, you were making it a thing. So it wasn't really stupid for people to, It isn't stupid for people to think you're in a relationship when you're putting that out. With Carson? No, it wasn't stupid that people thought that. No. Okay. Is there any other rumors? Like, is there anything that else that wasn't true? Uh, oh, I've confirmed like everything that is true so anything else is probably false true all right where's the biggest penis just let's just do it me come on man that's not content for the content please for the content yeah make it for a the deal. content yes all right uh well it's hard to say i think the person with the biggest dick was probably Oh man, I was really beat. Sorry, my internet went out. Oh, oh shit. Oh hey. 
Hey, what's up? What's up? I thought you just fucking left. No, my no, my internet went out. Sorry. Oh, true. Okay. Yeah. Uh, what was next question? Is it Fitz? Does he have the longest penis? He is pretty tall. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> fuck you, dude. Listen, if you put it out on the table, I do. Put it out on the table. Chat. Why did you ask me to put it out on the table? Every, okay. Everybody will <laughs> donate. Put, Chat. We have, table, we have like okay. twenty-five thousand viewers. Everybody will donate one dollar to you your next stream if you tell us the cock penis size. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. True. I'm not gonna talk about anyone's penises. Okay. okay? Yeah. Listen, if you if you really want to know, maybe you should go seduce them yourselves and find out their fucking cock sizes, okay? True. Yeah. Try your best. Good luck, buddy. How long until OnlyFans? Um, I actually will never have an OnlyFans. Sorry. Fuck. We're all crying. We're all. Oh no, that's what we wanted the whole time. How long until you make OnlyFans do that? You you do pretty well, honestly. Unironically, you'd do well. Yeah. You would. I wouldn't do bad. Yeah. I've got some thickums. Yeah, not bad at all. Not bad at all. You kill it. You should. You should do an OnlyFans. I would accept your OnlyFans. All right. Yeah. So you're gonna move on with your shit. You're gonna keep streaming. You don't care no about the fans. money. No more shipping content. Yep. Yep. Is there anything else you want to say? Um. I don't know. I, not really. Are there any more questions? Yeah. Nope. We're all done. Well, I mean, Leaf is here. Are you packing too, man? Huh? Yes. Seven You're packing? True. Oh. Oh. Maybe eight. Boring eight. Wow. But yeah. Eight inches of clothes for your next trip? <laughs> anyway. True. Yeah, anyways. Uh, Leafy is here. He DM'd you. You should probably respond to that. He told me to tell you that. But uh, yeah. Why, uh, why should I respond to Leafy? What'd you say? Why should I respond to Leafy? <laughs> well, he's a nice guy. You, you want to be the 28th? <laughs> true, 30th. Yeah, I mean, he's a nice guy. He just wants to yeah. talk about some bullshit. Now that I'm 50, bro. Collab. But yeah, yeah he wants to. I have no more questions for you. So, I mean, thanks for coming on. I was kind of mean to you and all, and I asked you some Mimi questions, but it's for the content. You get it, because you did the shipping content okay. with Carson. I don't care. Yeah. yeah, it's fine. All right. Cool. Thanks, you mad. Thanks. Have a good stream. Bye. Thanks, Katerino. Bye. Bye. Well, there's that. Fuck, man, my tier list didn't work. Man, I was excited to make that shit during the thing, but it never happened, man. What the fuck? That was weird. That was kind of weird. Kind of weird, dude. So, Chad, what did you think about the interview? Do I have a career in interviewing? Am I good at this shit? What do you think? What's your thoughts, Chad? By the drama alert theme song. It's, this is going to be on scarce, 100%. This is going to be on scarce. Probably not drama alert because he refused to talk about me, but... Fuck yeah, dude. We've done it. We've done it. The Gatorino interview has happened. True.